this JWH 1969 with a five package mail day. Um, I'm going to do this in two parts, um, mainly because I have a I have a group of trades from friends with a mystery pack, and then I have two care packages that were sent to me, and I'm going to do those separately. Um, one of them, I opened up the care package and saw the back of the card and stopped and thought, oh geez, I have another one here from Kyle. I'm going to do both these at the same time. I did not get to see the front of the card on the first care package. Um, and the second one I never even opened yet because I told Kyle I'd open it on camera. But I decided to do those two together. Um, so make sure you watch for your second video. I'm just going to go ahead and give you the warning. If the second video does not get posted, it means I probably had a heart attack. And so at least the, the trades and the mystery pack will get posted before then. Anyway, with that being said, uh, man spoke Ann Lynn, good friend of mine, traded many times with him. Um, we made a trade, and I'm going to start off with just the extras. This Eric Hosmer, awesome, shiny card there. Um, diamond card, um, very cool. Did not have that, and that's for my Royals PC. Um, got the Steve Slayton jersey card for the Texans. Um, I... You know what? It's numbered 1 out of 250, and I don't care. He's not on the team anymore. It's just a cool card, and so thank you. And then for my Deshaun Jackson PC, I don't know if I have this one or not, but very cool, and thank you for throwing those in. Those were all extras. And now for the trade, Ben Tate, um, Donruss rated rookies. That's out of those sets. You get one autograph per box. Very cool. Thank you. Um, Jamal Charles, same day. Um, autograph from the rookie signature photo shoot. Very cool. I actually got to see him pull that one out of uh, James's mystery packs. Got this uh, Ivan Rodriguez autograph. I, I absolutely loved Ivan Rodriguez um, when he's with Detroit Lions. Um, love in a manly way, remember. Anyway, um, great catcher, one of the best catchers behind Piazza. And then this for my Hall of Fame PC. Got this sick Paul Malder, numbered 1 of 18. Look at the pinstripes all the way through that break. And of course it is number 1 of 18. So very cool. Thank you so much, man, Spokane. Lynn, appreciate it. Second one is the first trade I've done with him, but I've actually messaged him a few times. Um, he's helped me out before, so I do appreciate it, Jack. Um, Mr. Bucks fan, 24. He decided to get rid of his Kendall Hunter um, PC. And there was one really nice card of mine he wanted, and I threw in a three-color patch of something else. But anyway, um, and he ended up sending me all these. And Jack, I appreciate it. And the note, very cool. Thank you. It means a lot to me. But here's the Kendall Hunter um, PC he sent me. We got the Prestige Rookie. Got rookie rated rookies. Um, the rookie card. We got the autograph from rated rookies. Got the platinum autograph out of an even even one thousand. Very cool. Got the rookie and stars dress for success jersey autograph. That one's number twelve of fifty. Got the RPM autograph or RPA jersey ball jersey. That one's number thirty one out of two ninety nine. Got another platinum patch. I think this is my third one of him. Um, and just a reminder, guys, Kendall Hunter is not my PC. Kendall Hunter is, uh, I have a friend who collects 49ers, and um, I figured these will eventually be going his way anyway. But a Platinum Patch Auto, that is a sick patch. The Finest Jumbo Jersey Auto. And then, last but definitely not least, the Red Zone Autograph number to 100. Um, guys, if you don't know Mr. Bucks fan, um, 24, go check him out, sub to him, good guy, I mean, uh, thank you, all I can say is thank you, and then last one is Matt Ward, got in his mystery packs, Matt's an awesome guy, he's a good friend of mine, millions of, why well, call him trades, but I guess they're not really even trades anymore, just send cards, anyway, with that being said, his mystery packs were awesome, pack of inserts, rookies, got my Sue rookie, never too many Sues. Marty Gilliard, Sage Head Auto. Michael Vick, Jersey. Number to 50. Jimmy Clausen, um, Rookie Review Card, Jersey. Got this uh, two color, three break. 
patch of Heinz, or of Willie Parker. Wish it was Heinz Ward. Willie Parker, number nine of fifty. Got this sick Harry Douglas two color two color with jumbo. I mean, just jumbo amounts of stitching going on there. Very cool. Number to seventy five. Got tandems of uh, Carson Palmer and Chad Ocho Cinco. Um, got this random, yeah, Ramses Barden, Upper Deck Black, illustrious rookie signatures. That is a very cool card. I think I've had one of these before. I think VZ got it. Um, VZ, let me know. Got this SP Authentic Patch Auto of Brian Calhoun. Um, just a sick card. Clean signature. I think this is probably one of my favorite years for SP Authentic back in 2000. What is it, 2006? Very cool. And then the my main hit, like that wasn't enough, Carson Palmer jersey autograph. That is just a beautiful signature. I gave up my uh, Carson Palmer autograph a few months ago to a friend of mine who I thought would appreciate it more. And I finally get one back. So very cool. And this one's number three out of 15. If you like something out of that pile, let me know. Uh, those were for uh, the last pile was for trade. But again, guys, hit up Matt Ward 513. Awesome guy. Yeah, I know you'll like him. Mr. Bucks fan. Jack seems like a great kid or guy. I'm just great trader. And then Man Spokane. Again, Len's, Len's pretty awesome. But if you guys uh, interested, let me know that uh, that first pile from Man Spokane was definitely not for trade. And there's a few cards mixed in that probably are. I ended up saying I'd make a trade video last night. Some of you guys knew that. Um, and I'm actually waiting on mystery packs that I purchased. It'll be three weeks tomorrow when they were broken. I'm still waiting on those, and they should be here. I thought they'd be here today. Of course, I thought they'd be here a couple weeks ago, too. They should be here to, uh, tomorrow, I would think, for sure. And if they do show up, I'll do an update for trade video. I just don't want to do an update and then um, turn around and have to update more. So, anyway, you guys take care. Have a great evening, and watch for my next video. Thanks.